So welcome back to the uh, pricing seven day challenge. Um, and so hopefully you started to get a picture of the value proposition now, which you're offering to your um, potential prospects and how to package up that product um, and how, how it differs from kind of what you're currently doing. So the main purpose of the seven day challenge really is just to start to change. It's not gonna be an answer uh, to the problems you're facing right now, but hopefully it's um, starting to help open up your mind uh, as to how you can do things slightly differently within your business. So we're on day five. Hopefully you've gone through days one to four, filled out the workbooks and shared those within the group. Day five is um, really just focusing heavily on your competitors and kind of getting you to think about sort of why you. So there's a couple of parts to this exercise um, that I want you to do. So I want you to go out and do a, a bit of competitor research. And what that means is I want you to find um, a dozen people in your industry um, some of whom will be charging the same as you, some of whom will be undercutting your, um, your, your industry and your prices dramatically, so I want, and some people who are charging much more than what you're charging. So I want you to make a list of 12 competitors, find those who are at the cheapest end of the spectrum for what you're doing, some, some of those who are at the most expensive end of the spectrum, make a list of the names, make a list of how much they're charging, and I want you to ask why they're charging what they're charging. So just write a line of text for each one of those competitors as to why, why you feel they're charging what they're charging and how they can get away with it. The second thing I want you to do is ask the question, like, how are you different to them? Like, how could you justify maybe charging a little bit more or adding more value into your, your product packages or the services which you offer? Um, and equally, you could also ask within that, like, what are you doing that the really expensive guys aren't doing? And I can guarantee that probably you're all doing a very similar thing. It's just some people are cutting corners, some people are just adding more value in. And you've got to try and position yourself at the top end of that sort of spectrum. So that's day five, competitor research, jump on the workbook, uh, put it out into online business startup or the fearless business group. Let's have some accountability and some, some um, chat going on between the group. And I'll see you again for day six.